I embrace boldness. I want to encourage each and every last one of you to prepare yourself for what God is about to do in this season of 2024, in this year of 2024. Prepare yourself for what God is about to do. But God is saying, prepare. The rain is coming. Everything that you've been expecting for God to do, just stay in the right posture. Stay grounded in the Lord. Keep that faith. Keep that momentum going. Keep that worship going. Keep getting God's word. Keep communing with him. Keep fasting. Keep praying. Keep that going. Because right now, in the midst of God preparing for the rain to come in our lives, and I'm not just talking about prosperity. I'm not talking about relationships. I'm talking about growing in the things of God. I'm talking about that rain. Just God's glory being revealed all over this world, this nation, this earth. And all around us, and even in our own lives, preparing for the rain. Because in the midst of the preparation, it's coming with tests and trials. God is going to prove us. He's going to test us in so many ways. And so many of us right now have kind of failed the test. And some of us, God has reminded us that we are still being proven and tested to see what we're going to do. Because God is watching everything. And a lot of us, God has been warning us and God has been letting us know about ourselves and it's on us. Well, now we're going to do what God has instructed us to do so that we can get to his best. Okay, so we can get to uh, the assignment that he's calling us to do in this season without any hiccups and hangups, but it's on us because we can't get mad at nobody else for not experiencing the things of God. When God has told us what to do, to prepare for his best, to prepare for what he's about to do. But we didn't take heed. We didn't listen. Or we just thought that it was a game. But you have to understand that the enemy knows that God is about to do something great in our lives and that God is about to do something great in the earth. And the enemy loves to come in when it seems like God is about to do something and use somebody to try to throw things off course or try to see what we're going to do if we're going to get in the flesh. But it's not going to work in this season. All attacks of the enemy is not going to work in this season. He's not going to stop what God has for us. He's not going to stop the rain that God is about to pour out in the earth. He's about to rain down in the earth. He's not going to stop it. And we're not going to allow him to cause us to miss out on what he has for us by not crucifying our flesh. By not ch choosing to be the new person, the new creature, the new creation in Jesus Christ. And leave the old man behind. We're not going to allow nothing or no one to stop us. We're going to keep going forth in God. I love y'all. Bless tribe. Let us rise and change this evil world that we're living in.